to my channel my name is Gladwell Kozak um, if you're new here please do feel welcome uh, and if, for all you guys who are always coming back to watch me uh, and watch uh, my videos I say thank you in today's video we're just going to dive in I'm going to show you what I have planned for today which is a shopping haul for IKEA this video is mainly for the purpose of just showing you the preparation um, items that I bought while I will be doing a proper video for organizing my pantry which I am getting back from my husband. We have a pantry in the house but uh, we use it's a, it's more of a multi-purpose pantry. My husband used uh, part of it uh, to store his uh, tools while I use part of it to put the stuffs and other things so finally because he managed to get his shed now I can get my pantry back and now I am starting to organize and that's why I am preparing by buying things and the shopping haul in IKEA is the beginning of my good adventure and I hope you will enjoy this adventure with me so come on with me so first of all I will show you uh, the gels that I bought these gels that I bought I bought two of the same and you have a bamboo uh, cover which I will show you how With this one you have a choice um, to either have a bamboo cover or a plastic container uh, a glass jar which has a plastic container which is able to clip in but I wanted this uh, bamboo uh, leads because I am planning to put flour in in one of these two but I will be eventually be um, buying some more so I will be able to have uh, maybe two or three more that I, I can put different kinds of flour so like this ones I'm planning to put uh, the flour uh, self-raising flour and the plain flour and on this one I am planning to put for example lentils and some uh, dry beans things like this these ones I am planning to put uh, pasta uh, especially linguine or uh, spaghetti and also other different kinds of, of, of um, pastas like for example at the moment I use uh, this kind of jars which I really like it's the same concept but these ones they are quite big and they can be able to hold uh, much more uh, grain or flour in them I also I bought four of this and these are fine they are good because they are quite airtight and they have inside of them they have the uh, plastic which when you you are clipping them together they do not uh, make a sound when you are closing them and you know they are airtight when you close them in so those ones I also prefer and I bought four of them because I think I will be needing them more these ones I also did buy, they are the same kind of um, glass jars which have uh, bamboo covers and as I said, with these ones you have the choice in IKEA, you can do either if you want bamboo jars or um, covers or you want the plastic covers, so it's always up to you. For me, because I am not planning to use these ones uh, in the fridge, that's why I prefer to use uh, the bamboo cover rather than uh, the plastic uh, lid so with this one you are covering like this and it's quite nice and tight and the good thing about this is they are stackable so when you stack them together they are not able to move so that way you can stack two or three together and you will not be afraid that they will topple over because unless somebody is moving them too much that's when they do so i am really excited because 
I will be doing different things and looking for different ways on how I will be using them. And uh, yeah, while I have managed to get all these little bits, I know I'm still a long way from uh, getting everything that I need. So I managed to get these jars. These jars I am planning to, they are just the little mini versions of this kind of jars which I will be putting uh, different kinds of spices on them, especially the herbs which you don't really buy them in big containers. So if you have two of, two of the uh, containers you just pour in here, I will be labeling them. I already ordered the label uh, from Amazon and I also bought different kinds of um, spice jars as well. These ones I will put the spices which I use more often and maybe I will be displaying them outside rather than putting them in the pantry. I also did manage to buy this container which I haven't yet thought what I will put but I think I will be putting some of the um, uh, bottles like this tiny bottles like that I think I will be putting some some of the things so it's it's not um, I cannot tell you exactly what I will be doing yet because I am still yet to decide how I am going to use all this as we go forward but is what I have bought at the moment and this is what I will just be figuring out how I will be using them but as you can see it's already looking neater and uh, a better way of organizing even, even is uh, good even for your own eyesight so with that I do also uh, want to show you um, the basket I also did buy a bigger version of the same but this one I will be using um, under the sink uh, drawer because this ones I will be putting um, the table uh, the kitchen uh, towels and I will also be using some other extra things I haven't yet completely uh, thought out the organizing way I will do them but that is the plan for now I also did buy this container which I find very in interesting it has um, a little plug that needs to be screwed in and then you can hold it in and this one I am planning to put um, things that are outside so that they are all kind of like contained in one place so they are not um, just being visible but they are easily reachable so those ones, that is a plan that I am planning to do with this. It's a bamboo box and I think it is, yeah, looking nice. Especially with the plans that I have for my kitchen. My kitchen is going to be renovated soon. So I just want to, my, to look for my kitchen to look a little bit more upgraded. These baskets, uh, I bought a black version of this from Matalan about two weeks ago and I have bought two of this in Ikea so I think these ones I will be putting them in the pantry some of them I've put for putting like the snacks and stuff like that so I will still be thinking what I will be doing with these ones but I think uh, with this uh, shopping haul I will start having a good uh, plan of how I will be um, arranging my country so other than all the um jars and and uh, the containers i also did buy some um hangers which i find very useful especially because i will also be doing my um uh, bedroom at some point in 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 uh during the summer and I think um, for the when you're using the metal um, hanger and especially you want to have clothes which after you've ironed they remain in a good shape 
this is a good way of using like for example one of these hangers so let's remove the hanger i'll show you how uh, With this one you just take the hammer and the clothes that you want to use and then for shaping so you use that so that way when you've ironed uh, your shirt or your 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 dress and you've hanged it on the hammer it still remains in good shape and uh, the crease it doesn't get too much creased up and uh, I think this is a good idea to have an add-on onto your hangers. So I bought six of them and they are very inexpensive. One piece is 50p, uh, so it is quite good value for money. Anything, any, any, anyway, all the things that I bought in here, even though I bought some other extra things for the bedrooms and for the, uh, for the children, which were not part of the pantry, I spent just about uh, 150 pounds which is not too bad because sometimes I go for shopping I don't even know what I have actually bought and I bring back almost nothing I also did buy this bamboo is a, a bridge for the bathtub uh, we are doing the renovation at the moment for the uh, bathtub and I think we have a plastic one which is really getting um it, it's not getting too cleaned up because with plastic it tends to absorb and keep moisture so i just decided to buy this one i hope uh my husband will be able to uh put some varnish so that it will uh, keep away from getting too uh too much moisture and getting spoiled but yeah I am really excited as the summer months are coming through and uh, yeah, the changes that will be happening around the house, doing my country, doing the bathroom and the toilet and then we'll be doing the kitchen and the, and the, uh, and the bedroom and the pantry and all these things I am planning to show you. Uh, so guys, be sure to stay tuned in and uh, work with me and walk with me and journey with me as I do as as we do the bathroom renovation, we do the pantry renovation and organization and kitchen renovation, which will be the last bits uh, in summer and also I will be doing my bedroom if time allows. So yeah, stay tuned in. And make sure if you like this video share with your friends give me a thumbs up leave a comment tell me the things that you may like or maybe suggestion or even places where i can buy uh things for my pantry cheaper if i think ikea is quite cheap but if there is a place where i can even find things cheaper please do let me know i live in the uk so um i can buy things from the internet and i can also buy things from uh, the shops that are available in the UK. So uh, without further ado, I hope I will see you in the next one. So bye for now.